Hello from the Eductor One team. In order to start up your Eductor One software, you must first have the device connected to the laptop via the special USB cable provided in your startup package. The USB cable must always be connected to the same USB port used during the first activation of the software. Please pay close attention to this. You can now turn your device on to start the software. As soon as the device shows Eductor is on, we are ready to start the software. But please always remember to reset your device between the sessions to avoid any lockups so all your sessions run smoothly. You can now double click on the Eductor 1 icon on the desktop to run the software. You will notice the software searching for the device searching for device on the top right hand corner. As soon as it is found, it says device found on the top right hand corner. If the device is not found, it will keep on searching. Usually the causes of the device not being found is the Eductor 1 device has not been turned on or the USB cable is not connected properly. Please refer to the troubleshooting video for more details on how to solve the issue. Now with this panel you can refer to how to connect the harness to the client if you ever forget. On the first line here we see the serial number of the device. On the second line we see the owner of the device and on the third line here we can create multiple users for one device and we can track the users per session. You will see how to do that in videos below. Create, for now, you can create a user, you enter the name, and when you enter the name, the name appears on the left drop-down button, and you select the user accordingly. Here is the language pack. At present, we have three languages, where the software is translated. You can change language between sessions. We will have many more languages. They're in the process of being translated at present. So we can close and continue to load the software. Here is the main panel. We will be discussing that in the videos below, piece by piece. Thank you very much.